what's good y'all it's your boy ross back at it again with another video so apparently edp 445 he has not shown any type of remorse for the situation he was caught up in a few weeks back he clearly does not care he's clearly not apologetic about it even though in the actual video that he got caught by the check ghosting crew he you know he seems so sympathetic and sorry and all this other stuff like well like he was sorry that you know yeah you know he got caught well not got caught but you know he's just sorry about the whole situation he, he felt like he needed help you know what I'm saying he's just he just had a different vibe than what he's on now you know he's trying to promote the website and apparently i've seen snippets of this i haven't watched the whole thing but apparently he made another video basically talking that trash man like not you know what i'm saying really really kind of going that check ghosting the the crew uh i think it's alex rosen is his name or something like that he was going at him in this particular video like i said i've seen snippets of it i just haven't watched the whole thing i wanted to kind of watch it on here with you guys and give my thoughts and opinions but it's just it's really sad because it's like yo man like at what point do you not realize what you did was really was really bad even though no one was actually hurt in the process of it it's still the fact that you was literally trying to meet up with an underage child you know what i'm saying like that's something's not right about that and you need to get some help but clearly he doesn't give a damn so we're gonna check this out i'm pretty sure i'm gonna have to put a lot of quack noises in this video which is gonna make this editing a little bit more strenuous than it should be because edp does not care about cursing in his vids he never has so this is one of them situations i'm gonna have to do that just to make sure youtube doesn't come down on me but yeah i'm gonna check this out edp 445 this isn't the end it's just the beginning my nigga, chet goldstein or should i call you alex rosen whatever the fuck your name is my nigga, whatever the fuck you prefer to be called you know here's the thing my nigga. let me go ahead and holler at you for a quick second see I've been making videos for coming up on 11 years now, my nigga, you feel me? I've been in the game for a cool ass minute. I've seen punk ass bitch made motherfuckers like yourself come and fucking go. You know what I mean? I've seen, you know, piece of shit, dip shit, punk ass motherfucking trash goddamn content creators like yourself. You know what I mean? Go from 10,000 subscribers and then automatically jump up to 108K because they're over here, you know, piggybacking, you know, off of the success of other fucking YouTubers, my <laughs> you feel me? You know, it, you know, it's a goddamn shame. It's a crime fucking shame, my nigga, at the fact that these motherfuckers aren't entertaining enough to sit back and provide the people with content. I like how he's trying to switch the narrative to put all the fault on Alex Rosen and the Chet Goldstein crew for exposing him for being on some wild stuff, but it doesn't erase the fact that what you got caught trying to do happened. They're 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 trash. Let's not get it twisted. Alex Ro Alex Rosen, the Chet Goldstein, that whole whole situation, trash. They're trash. Just off on their own. And I'm glad they got deleted off YouTube. But the only thing they did good was expose you, my brother, for being on some sicko mode type stuff. So, but I see what you're doing here, though. You feel me? And have six and have subscribers subscribe and actually be entertained by their fucking content. You can't fucking do that, my man. You feel me? You got to sit back and walk around here, make a fucking ass out of yourself in public, making fun of kids with Down syndrome and shit. There's a fucking video all over the end. I'm sorry. <laughs> I want you all to understand. He's over here trying to take this high and mighty road about Alex Rosen making fun of kids and stuff when you literally was caught trying to link up with the underage child. You just got catfished. Like, what do you mean? Like, that's like someone that's a robber. 
that robs people and takes their money trying to condemn someone that murders someone and takes their money. Like, oh, what you did, that's messed up, bro. I just rob them and take their money. You actually kill them and take their money. They're both bad. They're both wrong. I... All right. All over the internet of you, you using racial fucking slurs and shit. Oh man, the fucking n words, my shit, they'll be fucking offended, man. You know what I mean? Fuck these n words and all and all that fucking shit. Your credibility is fucked, bro. See, the difference between me and you is, my man, the fucking eat that fucking movement, my man. We riding fucking packs, bro. This ain't the fucking end. This is just the goddamn. It should be the end. I'm sorry if you support this guy after knowing what type of stuff he's on after what he got caught for and he's he's not even sorry about it he doesn't even want it like he's not sorry about it at all now but at the time when he got caught he was definitely sorry about it like I if you support this guy you're part of the problem bro I'm just be honest with you beginning mother feel me and we will continue to straight whip our dicks out and piss in bitches mouths my nigga you feel me we take care of our own you know what i mean is like you you're gonna fizzle the fuck out who the fuck are you dog you know what i mean some punk ass motherfucking red-headed leprechaun looking bitch. you feel me on some next level motherfucking, you know, I want to sit back and go eat some fucking Lucky Charms and shit. Who the fuck are you, bro? You know what I mean? Just like Donald Trump said, stand down and stand the fuck by. You ain't about fucking shit. You in that fucking mask wearing dweeb dork short pit squeak ass motherfucker, the CC unit. Motherfucker over here looking like a goddamn short ass fucking elf looking nun ass motherfucking shit with that big ass dashiki mask and shit on. You know what I mean? Get the fuck out of here, bro. You ain't about shit. And speaking of motherfuckers who ain't about shit, that punk ass motherfucker Cold Raven? Yeah, I see your little bitch ass motherfucker over there on fucking YouTube running your fucking mouth and shit. See, here's the thing, my nigga. This fucking website, and yes, bitch, the website is real. You feel me? It's gonna be popping. The website is real. This ain't no nigga. This ain't some troll ass video where it's like, oh, fucking, this is just some old video that he made five years ago. No, 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 no. See, the website is going to succeed. Why is it going to succeed? Motherfucker, because I love doing this shit. I love making content. You feel me? I actually love, you know, Bro, something's wrong with this guy, yo. He's not addressing the big elephant in the room. Him getting caught in 4K trying to link up with an underage child. That is the problem. Right there. Wow. Sharing my thoughts and opinions on quack, quack, quack. But unlike your quack, made quack, quack. mother quack. self, my quack. new content is whack as quack. fuck, Cole Raven. You just go ahead and give a quack. fuck up, my nigga. It's a quack. fucking rap. You know what I mean? You a snake ass quack. fucking piece of quack. shit, bum ass punk mother quack. fucking loser, and you ain't about quack. shit. You and that punk ass mother quack. fucking rap face snag a tooth ass quack. 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 bust a mother quack. Quack. Tyson, my quack. This shit is sad as quack. fuck. It's pathetic as fuck. And all you bum ass, hating, motherfucking, jealous ass quack. losers, my nigga, who've been sitting back talking shit. Quack. You know what I mean? Oh, man, the EDP's content is quack. fucking trash. It can't be that quack. fucking trash, motherfucker. Quack. My name has always been your quack. fucking mouth. If it's so quack. fucking trash, my nigga, why is my name constantly being brought up and shit? Quack. If it's so fucking quack. garbage, quack. and if my content sucks so much, quack. 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 stop talking about my ass. Oh, that's right, my quack. nigga. Um, your boy Eat That quack. 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 is bending you over the counter and quack. 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 I'm taking your quack. Quack. manhood, my quack. I'm nutting all across your quack. back and shit. Quack. You feel me? My, quack. my big ass fucking quack. Quack. nigga is smearing all up on... Nigga, my quack. fucking quack. quack is literally smearing cum all over your quack. fucking back. I am going to have a horrible time editing out 
most of the most of what he just said in this entire video. Y'all about to hear nothing but quacks in this fucking video. Damn it, I did it. I'm trying not to curse as much in you on YouTube videos because you know they be they really strict with that now. And it's, oh my god. I'm kidding, my big at all, but 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 you get the fucking idea. But, 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 but. You feel me? All you ass motherfuckers, man, that sit back, my got my motherfucking name up in your fucking mouth. Obviously, my I live up in your fucking head, rent fucking free. You feel me? Chet Goldstein, give it the fuck. Nigga, that whack ass motherfucking website, nigga, that you claim is supposed to be popping and shit. Bro, give it the fuck up, man. You know what I mean? Over here fucking saying that. I mean, god damn, dude. It's like, bro, give it up, my nigga. Give it the fuck up, man. Your credibility is fucked. You tried to take down good old eat that fucking 445, but guess what, motherfucker? We still in the flesh. The movement will continue. You have fucking failed, my nigga. You feel me? Just like all the rest of these punk ass motherfuckers, we content creating fucks made buster motherfuckers. They have failed. You feel me? Nigga, those little punk ass what? Fucking five, six thousand, seven thousand fucking subscribers. You shit, that's your motherfucking lifeblood. You feel me? I can sit back and take a shit. I can take a fucking and piss out 5,000 fucking subscribers. Get the fuck up, bro. You you motherfuckers failed. And your boy's in the motherfucking flesh, my man. You feel me? So suck my balls, eat my shit. Lick my and the motherfucking eat that point movement will fucking continue. Website coming soon, you bust ass. Uh, I don't even know, bruh. I'm more concerned about what I gotta do editing wise for this video, just so it can even be posted to YouTube. But, um, yeah, man. This is, uh, he just went on a, he's like, he's going on this tirade, like everyone's against him. And I, the thing is, a lot of people rocked with EDP because he did not care. He said what he was going to say and he did not care. And I think a lot of people related to that. That's really what it was. You know what I'm saying? I've, like I said, in the past, I've seen a few of his videos. And I thought they were funny because he just didn't care what anyone thought about him. And that's sometimes a good thing to have. That I don't care what you think about me. I'm going to do what I want to do what's best for me. But then when you do some wild stuff, you get accused of some stuff. And then you get caught doing it. There's DMs of you messaging an underage girl who you thought was an underage girl. They explicitly told you their age and you still continue to message them on some weird stuff. Then you get caught trying to link up with them. People care and people are going to look at you like something's wrong and you're going to get... That's, that's when you end up getting backlash. Like, this, this wasn't just no... Oh, you know what I'm saying? People just randomly just out to get you. Apparently, he's been accused of this type of stuff in the past. And now it's out there in the open. And now, you know, it's like, oh, well, you know what I'm saying? Y'all tried to cancel your boy, but I'm, I'm back. And I'm good. I'm better than ever. Bruh. Let's check out some of these comments. I know, boys, was going in on these comments, bro. Where was this energy when you met them in person? Oh, wait, my fault. You folded and cried, begging for forgiveness. That's what I'm saying. Where's this, this like, this tough guy energy coming from? Keep in mind, this is the same guy that said he always had a fantasy of being with someone young. And this is the same guy that uh, started crying when they said they were going to call the cops. I, th this is the same guy. Like, that's... Bro, I, I, I don't get it. You know what I'm saying? Like, what? Bro, what about the fact that you were actually caught trying to meet with a 13-year-old? The fact you feel no remorse makes me, makes me sick. 
Bro, EDP, real talk. Just turn yourself in before things get worse. That YouTube money ain't gonna last forever, and no one will hire you after what you did. You're done for, bro. I'm sorry. Just turn yourself in so at least you'll have a bed and being fed, fed and fed in prison. That's the thing. He didn't take. He didn't do technically something illegal. That's and that's what I want y'all to understand. He's not going to jail for this, so that's why he can say the stuff he says because. He's not going to jail for this. This wasn't... They didn't cooperate with the police beforehand doing this. So, all this that happened, no one technically got hurt. There was no underage child actually involved in this whole situation. They were just catfishing him. So, that's why he's not going to go to jail. He's not going to face no time because they did the investigation on Jakey. Like, they tried to expose him instead of actually getting law enforcement involved. They didn't. They just wanted to do this more so to get, you know, get that that type of clout on YouTube and get the subs of the money revenue. No apology video, no friends, no help, no sympathy, and no so. I used to be a fan for years, man, but this but this tough guy pers personality has all been an act when you when you record yourself. You got caught, showed your true colors, and let everyone down. You can never come back from this, man, no matter how hard you try. Own up, own up to what you said and go get help or be in jail. Wow. I think if he just got his cupcake and, and fist bump, he, he wouldn't be the same. <laughs> Apparently, you trying to link up with her for a cupcake or something. I'm like, bro, what? what? Yeah, man. And I'm sure a lot of more of these comments are pretty much the same thing. Like, where was this energy when the actual, when you actually got caught? You definitely wasn't on this type of time. Now you're on this type of time because you know you're not going to jail. You got your website about to jump, you know, about to start up your website. And let me make this very, very clear. If you support this guy's website, you're part of the problem. I know there's going to be some people that support because it's just, they're super loyal. They don't care. I'm sorry, I can't blindly follow someone that's not even remorseful about what he got caught for. Maybe, slightly, there's a bit, there's like a little bit of a chance of some type of redemption if he was truly remorseful, went to seek help, and maybe came back later. Maybe. Uh, a lot of people still wouldn't forgive him, but at least he tried to get his get stuff together in his head to know that's not right. But for him to come back here, double down and say, yeah, I'm starting up the website. F all you guys. I don't care. I'm about to do my thing. I'm talking my trash. Ain't nothing you guys can do about it. EDP 445 website coming soon. Join it. Like, what? Yeah, man. This this guy's he is sicko mode and not even not the good sicko mode. Like, this is this is not cool at all, man. So Hey, man, comment down below. Let me know. What's your thoughts and opinions on this whole EDP situation? He'll now going with this tough guy act now all of a sudden after everything is, you know, transpired. Comment down below. Let me know what you feel about this. And uh, I appreciate all your love and support on the channel. Road to 40K. Uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoy all the quacks in this video. I'm out.